Um, the concept being that if, if like me, you get a lot of emails, a lot of texts to you, and Facebook updates, and all sorts of different things, your phone's constantly getting a notification, you don't want to be keeping it into your pocket all the time, it could be something you don't even really care about. So with the Galaxy Gear, you're going to get your notification, a little vibration in your wrist, the notification will pop up, and from there you can decide what you want to do next. So if it's a text message, you can have reply, you can talk into the phone and reply directly. So if you use an email, you'll see the name and the subject header, and then you can decide whether you want to read the rest of the email. And if you do, you get a notification on the screen, you pick up your phone and your phone will automatically go to that email. You don't have to go and find it again or any of those things. It's smart enough to know what to get It's a really easy process. Um, so how does it figure out when you're looking at your phone? You're looking at the watch. So, so you get a message and then you pick up your phone and it shows what you were looking at on the watch on your phone. So how does it do? How does it know? So if the watch is awake, there's a constant yeah. communication between the gear and the device okay. and the Bluetooth. So as soon as you've clicked on the email to open it, yeah. it knows, that it sends the command that if it's asleep, like that, it'll send the command that as soon as it recognises a pickup or a right, turn Okay. On, so it's the gyroscope open. and stuff. Yeah. yeah. So okay. Then it'll go straight to the right place for you. So you don't have to search for anything, which is really cool. Because yeah. I don't know about you, but you get a notification, maybe you close it somewhere, but it'll still be on your watch. You just click on it and go straight to the thing. Yeah. Um, one of my favourite things about the gear is how easy it is to use. So there's there's no other buttons on it, there's no there's no need for them. Because it's the way it's designed, all you need to do is swipe from left to right like this. That'll take you through all the apps and all the menus. If you're on the clock screen, which is the home screen, here, I can just swipe from the top and I'll directly open the camera. So it's that easy. So if you're in that situation where you think oh, I need to take a picture of that, it could just be something uh, label that you want to buy for later, you can just press the button, uh, take a picture, and store and send to your phone automatically. It's, it's a really cool gadget. Um, and we're looking at how many different user cases we can make the most of this camera for. So things like shopping, so you could be taking a picture of a barcode, you could do an automatic search, you could do price comparisons when you're in the store. A lot of people do that with the phone to so uh, find the app. Now you just have to press the button, optical recognition, and it'll do it for you. And to close any application, what you do is just slide from the top. So if I'm in, uh, this member, for example, slide from the top, it goes back to the menu, slide again. And it uh, works with voice commands as well, so you can say, like, call uh, mum or whatever, and it'll do it. Exactly, yeah. yeah. So the gear comes with S voice built Okay. So a lot of the commands that you could do on, on the Note 3, you can do on the watch as well. So things exactly as you said, you can, you can say call someone, you can say search for something, you can ask it the weather. And if you get a text message, you can reply directly just by talking. Which okay. is really cool. And then, of course, you can make the call. Yeah. It's one of the most sophisticated things about the game. Like it's got its own dial pad, so you can dial directly, or you can go through your contacts. Um, from here. But one of the great things about technology in this, in this device is the fact that it's got two microphones in here, as well as a speaker. So it uses noise cancelling technology to work out whether the sound coming out should be retransmitted again. So all you do with the watch is you pick it up and you can just talk straight into the strap. As if you were and you envisage it. people holding it up to their face and talking. I, we, we envisage people holding it up to their face.